What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K20 My Team video. Guys, how are we doing today? Uh, we got another great video, a tip video for you guys today, guys. Before we start the vid, smash the like button down below, drop the sub. We're posting probably about six videos today, so get ready for the ride. We're going to get three tomorrow, three the next day, three the next day. And guess what? We're going to post three the day after that, so get ready. We're going to be great. We are going to post every day. We got gameplays coming at you. Right now in my team, I actually played the game all night, midnight release till 5 in the morning. Took a quick, I guess you would say, sleep, I guess. Not really a nap because it was like 5 hours, but we're back on. We're going to play all day. We're going to play Domination. And today, guys, um, I'm going to go over what packs you should pop. If you got that Legendary Edition, you got the MT, the VC. Um, I'm going to go over all that stuff. Why I suggest you to pop these packs right here. So... Let's get into it. Also, I'm going to recommend you guys to sell every car you got. Like, actually, no. Okay. You can sell every car. If you pull any heat checks, silvers, or bronzes, sell. You can keep your gold cards, your emerald cards, your sapphire cards. And those are the cards you can keep. Ruby and up, you can go ahead and sell because the auction is declining. Because there's so many people getting the game, popping packs, and all that good stuff. So, let's get into it. Um, this is my auction right here. This is why... I would say, do not pop those D-Way packs already. We're going to get into these packs. Now, listen, I popped them. If you did not watch my pack opening video, you can go watch it. It's the pre-order pack opening. I spent a ton of money on packs or 100 KVC on packs, a little bit of MT. I didn't really get anything. I got a decent amount of stuff, but here is what I'm going to say. So, ready. These packs right here. The League Primetime Box. So, these packs were in the game last year. And now I'm going to tell you one thing. These packs are absolutely trash. So stay away from these packs. I'm going to tell you why. So what I realized in these packs, um, you pretty much usually get a Sapphire in the pack every single time. So I would say do not pop these packs. First of all, they're 22 5 um, They're too expensive. You get five Sapphires. But you get no collectibles. You get no contracts, no coaches, no nothing. So... In my opinion, if you're going to drop, let's say you spend, you get three limits of these. You spend 22K on three of them, which is about 68K, 67K. Um, that is just not worth it. You're not going to get any coins. If you pull five Sapphires, you lose so much like potential. So let's get to the next pack. Um, this pack right here. We got the D-Wave pack. So now, yes, you can pull a ton of stuff from here. Not going to lie. Um, you could pull the best stuff. You could pull the worst stuff. But this is why I say this pack is trash already. Only way you make a ton of... Let's say I get a $450,000 box. I mean, 2K always like makes me pack hungry. As a player, I always want to pop packs. But this is what 2K has a problem in. So, they got these great deluxe packs. They look amazing on paper, correct? So, let's just look at the odds. So, this one is going to give you... Um, a guarantee, uh, it's going to give you a chance to get in the player. Four odds of a chance of pulling that spotlight series player. This one gives you, uh, only up to an emerald of pulling the spotlight series player. So, if it only gives you a chance, and this only gives you a chance, but this one guarantees it. But see, this one guarantees it. So you're like, alright, it guarantees it. But, what you're not reali realizing is that, since it's guaranteeing it, um, you're not going to get anything. I mean, all those dudes who are new in this game, I'm going to just tell you right now that this pack is probably one of the worst packs you could ever pop. I popped probably four of them. And what, what, what do you think I pulled if I pulled four of them? What do you think I pulled? I pulled not even a Sapphire. I pulled Michael Beasley three times. Um, I pulled Udonis Haslam and Aaron Mickey. So... Why does anybody want to pull that? And guess what? Want to know what they go for? Let's just check. I'm going to show you what they go for. So now, that's yet yeah, at the worst, but you have to realize that since 2K is making that money, they're really money hungry early in the game. Um, I'm going to show you real quick. So Michael Beasley is going for a whopping 1K. So imagine pulling 10 of those packs and getting Michael Beasley 10 times. I've watched YouTubers, I've watched Cash Nasty. Pull a giant bundle, and he only pulled an amethyst. Guess how many boxes he popped? Want to know how many boxes the dude popped? He popped six of these boxes right here. You know how much VC? You know how much money that costs you? It costs you um, 
six of those 168,000 so do the math that is well over what $200 so it's no well over a hundred dollars so that is not worth it i'm not trying to spend money i'm a all i'm a grinder i didn't spend any money besides the legendary edition i would stay away from these packs yeah if you pull mellow it's gonna be great but what happens if you pull ai see if you don't pull any amethyst want to see what the most expensive ruby is i mean let's see if they fix the auction i know last night the auction was bucking so let's get into it we got ai uh sh 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 let's get into it maximum buyout let's see if they fix the auction all right so look if you pull no amethyst, which is very high, I mean, the pack odds in 2K, you already know the best cards are really, really, really expensive. So, you get 10K. 10K MT is absolutely nothing in the beginning of the game. Um, let's check out Eddie Jones. These packs are dissecting these packs. I don't think they're worth it, in my opinion. Let's check Eddie Jones, shooting guard, 88. That's actually a snipe. And we got it. So, okay. So, he's going for 12k. Is that a lot of coin? No. I don't think that's a lot. So, we're going to sell him for 12.5. It looks like the auction has replenished itself. It looks like it is not as broken as it was last night. I mean, they had a weird auction glitch. I posted about it. You guys can go check it out. But, yes, guys. So, let's get into the packs. These are the best packs you could possibly pop. Um, the league packs. Why do I say this? Hmm. So, first of all. They're cheap. They're half the price of the DOA packs. Second of all, they don't guarantee you crap. And they guarantee you a second player. So, these fill out your collection. Also, I'm going to tell you why these packs are good. First of all, there's a lot more value in these packs. And let me tell you why. So, ready? You're going to go over here to Luka Doncic. And you're going to go over here to Przingis. These Sapphire players actually have value right now in the beginning of my team. Um, Sapphire, some Emeralds have value. Um, let's let me just show you Luka Doncic is actually kind of expensive. I actually sniped him out for 4k yesterday. He is going for around Is he really over 8k or is the auction still lagging? Oh, ah, yeah, it looks like the auction still lagging here. Let's see All right. Wow. Okay. So exactly. There's my point. Luka Doncic is 13k So a sapphire out of a league pack with 6k MT that's cheap Want to see what else is good in this pack with a Sapphire? Poor Zingod. Very cheap. Oh, uh, you could also pull Clay Thompson. There's way, just, there's just a lot of better options in this vid, in this uh, pack. So we got 13k for poor Zingod. So another Sapphire that you could pull, which is not too rare. Not rare, but I would say it's pretty common, I guess. You could pull a Sapphire. And the price difference, you could go 12k MT or 9k VC versus 5k VC, 6k. All right, you know what? For the video, we're going to pop one of these bad boys. Maybe we could pull something good. Let's pray. Oh, look at that. It's a ruby. Is it a player, though? Probably not. Oh, it is player. Look at that. Look at that. We got Carl Anthony Towns. Listen, guys. I'm telling you right now. Do just listen to mugs. Don't pop those trash packs. Go pop those packs. Um, I'm telling you right now. Look, we just pulled Carl Anthony Towns. We pulled one pack. We pulled a ruby out of it. I mean, let's get it. Um, let's check his price. Carl Anthony Towns. We, we spent 6K on the pack. He's well over 6K. Oh, wow. Okay, so rubies aren't that expensive. I guess sapphires are more rare. All right. All right. We're still going to make coins. We are going to make a whopping about... I'm keeping them anyways. All right. So we're going to make about 2K off that pack. Plus the, the coaching. So we're probably making about 3K. Now listen. Guess who just got added to the squad for 6K? We got Cat on the squad. JaVale McGee's got to get the boot. The squad's looking pretty solid. I spent no money on the game. Uh, we got T-Mac up to a Sapphire. We sniped out Doncic. I'm 3-0 I'm and overall. I'm 2-0 and in triple threat. 1-0 and in the game. Now listen. You're going to pop packs. Think about how much more value you get out of this. 101,000. You get 20 packs for 101,000. Or you get 20 packs for 168,000. Hot, a very low chance. I'm going to tell you right now. The pack odds on 2K are very low. I mean, like, they're stupid low. 2K is out to get you. They're not trying to, like, they're, they're money hungry. 2K is one of the most money hungry games. They do not give you out with this. I've been playing 2K for years. You're not going to get an out with this. The chances you get an out with this are probably, like, 2%. No joke. These packs right here are great. If you pull an Amethyst, you make more money than what the Amethysts are going for. It goes more from the... If you got AD or Kawhi, it's like more money than the Tim Duncan. So really, the only thing you can pull the D-Way that's good is Mellow. Which, why take the risk when these packs are half the price? You can pull double the amount. 
get more stuff out of it. I mean, it's a no-brainer. So anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed the vid. Stay away from those D-Way packs. Get ready. Drop the sub. Hope you're new. Have a good one. Peace. Tomorrow, take it flat.